Hello everyone, this is Alejandra Gomez with CreativeDaily.com and today I'm going to show you um, one car featuring the Peaceful Puppies um, new suite from Stampin' Up! and let me just go through the um, pages and this is from the uh, new spring catalog and you can see here different samples and I just love this collection so much There's so many new products here. The design series paper is just fantastic And then there's two bundles that will go perfectly with this um, suite and today we're gonna be using actually the peaceful moments bundle Which I show you in a second <clears throat> But so anyway, you can see um, More details here. Let me just yes, you can see more details here of the different suites and like i said this is a great 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 suite to go for um so anyway as i mentioned there are two stamp sets here each of them has a different uh set of dies so the peaceful moments go with the poppy moments which i love because you can build your own puppy flowers and you're gonna see me doing that today and then there's also this one that has already the stamp images with the puppies um, where you can uh, color them and do so many other techniques with this one. And then, of course, there's this um, this die set that is called the painted labels dies, which go with this one. Now, what is cool about this is a lot of the frame leads, um I'm sorry, a lot of the labels that you get here can go really well with the sentiments in this one so definitely you want to get both of them um to make sure you get the best out of them so let me just get a start here let me just show you oh and one thing i forgot to mention is that um these two hold on these two labels do embossed and cut at the same time and i don't know if you can catch it here but you can see here on this one that it cuts and then it also has a little embossed line. This is done on the one pass as you are going for your big shot. So definitely, definitely a great, great, great um, die set to get. So I have already die cut a lot of the pieces and I'll go here in a second. And then also there is this gorgeous design series paper, which is um, called the Peaceful Puppies Design Series Paper. And uh, you're gonna see the vibrant colors on this one i am so in love with this because you can make so many cards with only the design series paper and i'll show you some samples in a bit just give me one second here um just so that you can get more ideas so you can see it here here's another one using the die sets that we're going to be using today there is another one and you can see the design series paper alone makes the trick um, how about this one? Again, the Sciences paper is just the, oh, this is not from this collection. Um, and you can see this one. So again, great, great, great set to have. So let me just go over measurements real quick. So my car base is eight and a half by five and a half in Whisper White, and this is a thick car stock. Then I have a piece of that gorgeous design series paper, and this one is three, by three and three quarters and i have another piece of that design series, the same design series paper and this one is two and a half by four again these uh design series paper is out of the peaceful uh peaceful poppies design series paper and you can see all the colors are so vibrant the other thing that i have done like i've mentioned is i have die cut the label out of whisper white and then i have also die cut um all these elements um let me just show you here so these are again out of the poppy moment so we have die cut this one in uh, puppy parade this one in real red which is that one then i have die cut um one of the leaves in um old olive which is this one and this 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 one which is that one and mossy meadow i also die cut this little black um area so it was using that one and then i have cut these little guys in old olive which is one of these and one of those and then two ovals using that one and so i just want to make sure you know all the little pieces i know it sounds like you're die cutting too much but honestly you can line up too many of those pieces in one run and go it through so it's not as um, as bad as you're thinking, honestly. 
Now I'm going to be using, the reason I'm doing this first is because I wanted to uh, wait for it to dry while I am assembling the car. And so <clears throat> I'm going to be using the um, fine tip glue pen. And we're going to go ahead and start gluing everything here. So we're going to be adding, you can see here, we're going to be adding here. Okay, a little bit of this, and you can see how I'm doing this. It's just a little bit all over. You can also use this punch and your um, thumb of glue and a sponge it. I honestly like a lot using this one because it dries super fast and I just love that. And so anyway, we're gonna go ahead and wind this up. Okay. And I'm gonna put a block here for a second. And then for this one, I'm gonna go ahead and do the same. And you can see how I am. Now this one, um, dries, um, clear. So don't worry too much about it. You just line it up. You can see it here, line it up. And I'm going to be putting this one as well. And then for this one, actually, I'm just going to use now once you're done. Oh, you know what? I forgot that one. Let's just do this one first before I forget. So for this one, we're going to go ahead and uh, we're going to go ahead and put it like so. And uh, once you're done, make sure you always um, <clears throat> close your glue because you don't want to have, um, you don't want it to be clogged up. Now for this one, I'm actually just going to use uh, glue dots and I'm going to put one glue dot here and add it to this section. You can see it here okay and the same is going to be true for this one actually on this one let me just see yes i'm also going to put here and i'm going to hide those little blue dots so that you don't see it and we're, we're going to put it like so and there you have it all right so that's all we're going to be doing with those now let's get uh, let's put your car together and you can see it already kind of dry up now um my sentiment i'm going to be putting them i'm using this the one from the sentiments that is called wishing you every happiness is a special day uh, will bring and we are going to use our Memento ink pad. Just need to make sure I get a really good black image here. And stamp it. Don't rock it. There we go. Perfect. Love it. And um, we're going to go ahead and fold this one in half. We're going to go ahead and fold this one in half. Use your little folder. Then I'm going to go ahead and put this one like so and this one like that. So let's just glue this down. And again, I just love the 
this science series paper. All the vibrant colors are just are just yummy, don't you think? I mean, all of it is really gorgeous. So I'm just gonna put it like so. There we go. And then we're gonna go ahead. It's like both sides of this design series paper is just adorable. Seriously. And we're gonna go ahead and put it like so. And then we're gonna go ahead and bring this one. <clears throat> right? And so for these, I'm gonna go ahead and line up everything. Yes. So we're gonna go ahead and let's just put this one first on dimensionals. Give me here one second. Hmm. All righty, and then I'm going to go ahead and it does as well with dimensionals. So I want to add some dimension to the whole thing. Alrighty. And um, I'm going to go ahead and put also those on dimensional, so. You are going to love this card, and we're almost done, I promise you. So I think this one will go really good there. And then this one here. Yes. Or maybe I can put this one right here. Let's just think about this for a second. And have this one right here. Oh, I actually like that one better, I think. So I'm going to be adding a tiny... Actually, no, I have one of these. So let's just add one of these. Oh. This one has to go underneath his. There we go. And then this one, same thing. We're going to go ahead and put that one there. And we are going to be done. And there you have it. Is that not gorgeous? I think it is. I just love how easy it is. And you can just build up as many of these little flowers as you want. So anyway, so thank you so much. I really appreciate you joining me. If you are watching this on YouTube and you like it, please give the thumbs up and also subscribe to my channel as well as click the bell so that you get notifications when the new um when a new video is uploaded and also if you're watching these on facebook make sure you like the facebook page it really helps me a lot so thank you so much and i'll see you soon thanks bye